Hello guys, welcome back to another video. So today what I'm going to do is I'm just going to show you guys um, the basic programming of a dip switch garage door opener, okay? So guys, it's basically easy. All you have to use is this like flat-headed screwdriver and then push these little switches up and down. And guys, um, up here means on and down here means off. You guys can have it in any cert certain of pattern. You can have it on, off, on, off, on, off, or on, 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 or off, 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 etc. Any way you guys want it is up to you guys. And guys, if you guys want to have it um, program, you guys gotta match the uh, program that's currently on the opener up here if you guys want this up here to work, all right? And guys, um, the wall button over here is different than programming your remote. So guys, all you have to do with this button here is, though, I, if you wanna connect it, all you have to do is just wire it over here to the back of the opener. See the wires up there, guys? The wires go up through here, back down over there. All right. So, guys, I'm. If you guys want me to, I can demo this garage door opener going up and down one time. All right. So here we go. All right, guys. Here it goes down. Okay guys, so I'm gonna show you guys this remote right here running it so you guys can basically see how the programming works, all right? So I'm gonna set you guys down here and I'm, I'm gonna change the battery from this one, from the battery from this remote to this remote real quick, all right? So give me a second guys. Alrighty guys, I got it in. And let me uh, put this back in here so you guys can uh, so you won't lose the mechanism. This one. All right, we got it. Okay guys, so I got the new battery in for this remote here and I can, I'm can i gonna show you guys how this one works for this one, okay? So you um, will need this button to put back together and all you have to do guys to put this thing back together is just match it like a puzzle piece, so look. Let me show you guys with my camera up higher. So all you guys have to do is just do it like this, okay? Put it in, in like this, and snap it, and then it's put together. Okay, so um, this one is currently programmed with that opener up there. I'm just gonna show you guys of like when I push this button and what it will do. All right, here we go. Oh, guys, so the battery is messed up real quick. Let me do that real quick, then I'll show you guys. But, um, all right, so let me show you like what it does real quick, guys. Um, I put the battery in incorrectly, and I'll, I'll show you guys that in another right, clip. Guys, See, I'm back. I got the battery uh, turned around on this remote, and I'm just going to show you guys what it does when I push the button when you have it programmed and ready to go, okay? Here we go. Alright guys, so you guys saw what happened? When I pushed this button with the program, that's what it did. Alright, so let's put this down. Here we go. Okay, so when I push this button guys, this light right here turns on. Let me show you guys that. See, when the light, when I push this Button here, the light turns on. All right, so that's pretty much how, uh, all I have for you guys. Um, I hope you guys enjoy it, and I apologize if um, I didn't show you guys how to program it well. Um, I'm not really a full expert about programming dip switches, but I did show you guys that in the cup in the first part of the video. Okay, so um, I hope you guys enjoy it. And if you guys are wondering what video I'm going to do next, I'm gonna sh um, run the Chamberlain uh, LiftMaster one half horsepower chain drive garage door opener at one of my rental properties, and I show you guys what it came with except the remote because it wasn't there. All right, so um, I'll see you guys in that video. Have a great day and please like and subscribe and I'll see you that, I'll see you guys in that, and I'll see you guys in that next video. Bye guys, have a great afternoon.